Hey, there, in this video we're going to talk about why minimum flow is important for pump design. So, first let's understand what minimum flow is. Minimum flow refers to the lowest flow rate that a pump can operate without damaging its internal components. In other words, if the flow rate drops below the minimum flow rate, the pump may overheat, suffer from cavitation, or experience other forms of damage. This is why it's so important to design pumps with a minimum flow rate in mind. A pump that doesn't have a minimum flow rate will be prone to damage and will have a shorter lifespan. Cavitation is the formation of bubbles in a fluid when the pressure drops below its vapor pressure. When these bubbles collapse, they create shock waves that can erode the impeller and other internal components of the pump. To prevent cavitation and other forms of damage, centrifugal pumps are designed with a minimum flow rate that ensures that the fluid in the impeller stays above its vapor pressure. This minimum flow rate is usually specified by the pump manufacturer and should be followed closely to ensure that the pump operates safely and efficiently. So, in summary, minimum flow is important because it ensures that a pump operates safely and efficiently without suffering from damage. If you're designing a pumping system, be sure to take the minimum flow rate into account to ensure that your pump has a long and trouble-free lifespan.